Here at Golfing World, we found ourselves California dreaming recently when we travelled to the rolling hills of North San Diego to take a look at one of the West Coast's top golfing destinations, Madeira's Golf Course. The golf course was designed by Johnny Miller, US Open champion, and Robert Muir Graves. It opened in November of 1999, so we just turned 15 years old. The course itself is a championship uh, layout, par 72, plays 7,167 yards from the tips. There are a number of different tee boxes on each of the 18 holes, so you can tailor your experience to your level of play. The course is tucked into hills and canyons and weaves its way through spectacular surroundings of cliffs, creeks and forests. There are five waterfalls and three lakes, but as well as the scenery, it offers a serious test of all aspects of the game. The golf course itself has a remarkable layout. Time and time again, we hear from most golfers that each of the holes themselves are quite memorable. And I think in some cases, uh, being able to leave Madeiras and recall your shot on hole 15 or recall your shot on hole 18 leaves a, a, a strong and lasting impression. The course is one of only two in San Diego to be listed in Golf Digest's top 100 greatest public courses. Madeiras offers state-of-the-art practice facilities including a three-tiered driving range and two long pitching areas onto putting greens. A team of PGA pros are on hand who are especially keen to develop young golfers. So we have a terrific uh, golf academy, the Madeiras Golf Academy. It's home to the USA Junior National Team. So every week we have the elite players in San Diego come here and um, hone their skills with our top coaches. We also are home to uh, many PGA Tour and LPGA Tour players. Um, they come here and use the TrackMan and they come here and um, use these facilities. Um, the facilities are on the range and the short game area are so good, probably the best in San Diego, and that allows them to hone their games. So it's really a, a terrific place for the elite players and, and the beginner players to come and get better. The course starts with two medium-length par fours and a 583-yard par five to help ease the players into the surroundings. Every hole offers a challenge with undulating fairways and huge, fast and often elevated greens. The final five holes are particularly demanding, but all are memorable. The great thing about Madeiras is that every single hole is really different, so you never get bored playing the same course all the time. It's, um, every hole um, is either uphill or downhill, it's kind of cut into the canyon here, so um, it really offers um, different experiences on each, on each hole. Uh, my favourite hole is the 18th hole, it's par 5 and comes back towards the clubhouse. The uh, tee shot is a forced carry over the canyon and um, you actually hit up into the, into the mountain so you can see the golf ball go up into the mountain. And then as you come back, um, the, uh, there's a water feature on the, on the right side of the green. So uh, the longer hitter can get there in two, but um, the shorter hitter will still have a challenging third shot into the green. Madeiras is Spanish for woods, and with more than 170 oak trees around the course, it certainly lives up to its name and reputation as a beautiful and exceptional golfing venue. There are 93 courses in the county. This one continues to be a favorite in large part because I think uh, credit to the team and the designers, we're able to execute great conditions, uh, super customer service, and uh, great amenities. And I think when you travel or when you're celebrating a special occasion, uh, you certainly expect those three items to go hand in hand and to a large extent I think this club, its team uh, and all those involved focus on those three uh, elements each and every day.